We'll be looking at navigation within the database. The buttons or ovals allow you to move around the program and select what you want. Main menu is home base. When you're in a particular area, you can toggle to the list view. Uh, by the way, you can um, sort records by these underlines. List view is really for looking quickly, and the full view is for entry. The program runs scripts, and scripts is another. These are basically all scripts, and the program runs those. As I said, for example, you could. There's some extra ones here, like table view, looking at attendance records is a nice one, but you can kind of get around through that method as well. Best way to take attendance is really to just pick your date after you've entered all of your programs and other information and you're ready to go. Um, it will run a script and you can see it's kind of a separate window so you, you can uh, check uh, who's there. Very important to click done, that will close the script and then again you're back to base. So scripts do run throughout the program. Another little thing I can reduce the size or make it bigger, which is again using the keyboard I could tab through items or shift tab to go back. It's a nice little trick. You'll notice little icons throughout the database such as the enroll icon where you can again run a script and do it. I want to iterate, reiterate that the inactive button or the active button, um, this basically keeps the names or the programs on the drop down menus. So if you want to take one off of a menu, uh, you can just click inactive. If you're entering a lot of seventh graders, for example, you could, uh, when you create a new record, uh, you could enter some pieces of info here to save a few clicks. Note, and note as well in the database that you'll notice that the student ID with no data will turn red. Uh, so it's when you see that color, it should be an indication that something needs to be done or something is amiss. The only other piece related to color is uh, purple denotes a connection to federally required reports. Thank you.